Hello everyone, uh, this is my fourth video with class 8 A and B and uh, if you remember the last time we just started with the poem Escape by Richa Gupta. So this is in continuation with that poem. Um, before I start I would just like to give a brief introduction about what we did in the, in the, in the last uh, video. And this poem was about deforestation. This poem was ab is about the ill effects of deforestation and how a cutting down of trees and forests and, and green grassland, green area affects um, directly and indirectly to everyone um, around uh, the forests. Um, we are talking about all the animals who uh, live in the jungle, on the trees and the vegetation, um, animals who are dependent on forests for food and shelter. So, so many things that has um, affected um, the jungle. So, coming to the second stanza, um, what I am starting with, let me just go through and read a couple of lines. It's a very long uh, poem, so I have, that's why I have, I'm breaking down every stanza and taking uh, time and going a little slow. So, second stanza says, if you can go on your book on page number 34, um, it would be good if you can read it from your books and uh, open your books so that it will help you to make your own notes on the book. The mother's eyes dilated with fear as she held her cup close, cup close. Against her breathing heart, she stroked its quacking head, whispering one words of comfort of which she did not believe at all. Till here. So now as we have come to the situation where and now we have come to know that the forests are gone, the trees are gone, how these people have come and they, ha they, are, they are cutting down all the trees and ignoring all the animals and, and, and uh, living things, all the um, birds and animals who, who live on the trees and in the jungle. And now they have come to a point, there's a, if you can look at the picture also on page number 35, the story, the, the story in, in, the, in the second stanza is talking about a tiger, a young mother, and uh, how she is holding its cub, its baby. Her, the mother's eyes dilated with fear. Dilate means when you widen up your, your eyes with fear, with surprise, with shock. And the mother's eye, eye, uh, eyes are, have be, are widened up with, with shock, with fear. Not fearing about uh, its own life, but fearing about uh, its its um, offspring, its uh, cub's life also. Mothers, young mothers, particularly uh, mother, uh, wild animals who have young ones, are very, very protective of, of their uh, babies. So the mother is afraid. She doesn't know what is happening. And she can see all the trees are gone. She doesn't know where to go. And at the, at the, at the same time, most importantly, she has a cub. She has a baby, so her eyes are all are widened up. She has opened her eyes very, very big with fear. With she, she's afraid. She's scared. As she held her cup close, holds past tense held, and she's holding her cup, her baby, very close to her heart. She's afraid, and she's trying to protect her baby, save her baby at the same time, because she knows that the baby is that the cup is also very afraid. Children can, can sense fear. In the same way, wild animals, offsprings and babies can also sense fear. So the baby is also, the cub is also very, very afraid. And what the mother is doing, the mother tiger, she's, she's holding her baby very close to her heart, trying to console that everything is fine, everything is, I'm there to protect you and guard you, against her beating heart. And she can feel her baby's heart beating as she is holding her baby. Imagine this. It's, it's a very sad situation. How would you feel if someone just invades in your house and tells you to get out of your house and you're forced to leave your house? Something like that. So against her beating heart and she, the mother, the tiger mom, she can feel, she can feel the baby cub's uh, heart is beating so fast. When does your heart beat fast? When you either you are exercising, you're running, or most importantly, when you're nervous and afraid. And stroked its quacking head. And the mother tiger is, is stroking the, the shaking, the trembling head. Quacking here means shaking, trembling head of its baby, of its cub. 
the mother is trying to comfort the mother is trying to you must have go, uh, gone through such a situation when something bad happens or you are worried or something happens your mother is the first one who will come and embrace you who will give you a tight hug she'll kiss on your forehead she'll make something nice for you she'll give you she'll 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 um, comfort you with 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 warm words and a warm hug something like that the mother is trying to comfort the baby the cub whispering words of comfort you know again the poet has personified if you remember these are writing tools um would just like to mention one thing here in between also and I'll, I'll i'll reiterate at the end of the video that i'm going to repeat all the writing tools in the in the next video so that you get a better picture of 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 how to write poems and how things are done so i did mention it in the previous video also so whispering words of comfort the mum is not whispering the mum cannot talk it's a wild animal but here uh, the poet has used human qualities of of comfort of of talking comfort words uh, with the tiger where she is holding the 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 baby so tightly so tight that the baby knows that my mum that the cub knows that the the tiger mum is there to protect her of which she did not believe at all but the mother knows you know there may be so many things that are worrying your parents but at the end of the day if you look at your father's face or your mom's face all they'll say is that everything is has been taken care of they'll not sit and discuss all the details of what they are going through every parent does that so but in the same way and they but they'll make sure that you feel safe and secure and and uh, you are happy when you when you 